What is up guys, Winter Kills here. Welcome to a type of video I haven't done in a long, 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 long time. Uh, for various reasons, but I've seen some other people do this, i.e. Cali Effect. I see him do, uh, you know, his binder showcases and stuff, and I figured, why not do one for me? I, I have, uh, my binder and then, uh, my brother's binders. Um, they was kind enough to let me borrow for this video, otherwise it wouldn't be that <laughs> too, uh, too good. I was originally just gonna do his two binders, uh, but I figured people would probably want to see mine, I guess, but, um... Yeah, we'll go ahead and do a, a quick little binder showcase for you guys. I think I did this for like a 2,000 subscriber special, so that was a while ago. Um, we'll start with my binder, and uh, I also want to preface this video uh, to start, because I know I'll get comments. Nothing is for sale, nothing is for trade, I am not looking for anything. Um, I'm just under a strict don't get rid of anything policy, because I always end up needing it again in the future. So getting rid of things is more of a hassle than anything same goes for my brother's stuff so not buying not selling not doing any of that simply just show it showing you guys what's in my binder and what's in my brother's binder um things of that nature so uh we'll go and get started uh also check me out on socials and uh check out imperium duelist as well guys so that uh so first page it's i know it's a pretty fantastic page um i will start you know we have we got the rare drolls boys the artifact lancias and the dimensional barrier secret rare now i also want to say my binder is not as good as it could be because all of my good stuff is in my decks i have like 11 decks i need multiple decks i'm constantly taking things in and out of them out of my binders and putting them into the deck so um there's a lot of stuff that could be in here that i didn't feel like dismantling all of my decks to put in here to make it look better i just have sort of the best of what's not being used at the moment um so yeah uh next page here uh, Lapis Dragons, uh, I have five total super rare guns, this one's Italian, uh, someone in Discord helped me, uh, hook, hook me up with this one, um, so I got those, Lances, LBs, Zafions, uh, the Super Underclock taken, these two Iblis are actually, uh, my friends, he's let me borrow them, uh, a while ago for a tournament, and, uh, I still need to give them back to him, his, he, uh, hurt his foot pretty bad, so he won't be able to come, uh, grab him anytime soon, just holding on to him for the time being until, uh, we can meet up. Uh, next page, we got Super Rare Destrudos, Twin Twisters, called by, I must have, like, 30 copies of this card, but I have a spare play set in here. Uh, Super Morays, I used to play this in Mermel, you guys know that, Super Rare Mor Morays, uh, Return of the Dragon Lords and uh, Medions. I have the Medions and the Zafions because I think those are like the best side deck cards uh, for Time Lords uh, that you could probably play. Uh, next page here uh, three Slumbers, three Breakthroughs, three Allures. Kind of break up the playset theme here a bit. Um, Squallow Bahamut Italian, Shooting Riser Dragon. I actually just got this in the mail today. Alti Yazi, Secret Yazi, uh, DT Delorean, and Gungnir. I have a Brian act, but that's in my uh, Mermail extra deck. Uh, formula, uh, Leo, and a uh, ultra rare uh, librarian, super rare Leo, very, very nice. Uh, three Spectrum Supreme, three Corian Gandrix, three Red Reboot, Neo Space Connector, Alistair Supers, and the Aqua Spirits, all Labyrinth of Nightmare uh, prints. Still don't know. I still don't know why we don't have a new print of this card. Um, just all cards that are just waiting to be used essentially for something in the future. Uh, Dogarons are all out of the, the structure deck. Uh, three Hornet Drones, three Galaxy Cyclone, three Pinpoint Landing. Still waiting to use these. Uh, three Astrograph. I always keep banned cards, uh, just because you never know. Um, Triple Summon Limit. Gotta have that card. Uh, Fiendish, Curse Seal, uh, Spellbook Star Hall. You guys know I have Spellbooks as well, and I might play these in here at some point in the future. Three Rescue Ferret. Um, I don't know why I have this card, I just do. Uh, three Unending Nightmare, First Set Secret Original Set, and Three Ultra Rare Eater of Millions. Always wanted to try and play this card, I think, but never never got around to it. Uh, more Random Synchros, um, Vulcan, uh, Barrage Blast. These are DT Puppet Masters. Um, I don't know. I picked these up to play in uh, DDD because it's a pretty spicy tech in DDD, but I just never end up keeping in there for long. Uh, three Should All Core up at the top, Duelist Alliance. Um, I don't think they're first edition, which I thought they were, but I guess they're not. Three Secret Village and three Cyclone. Uh, Danko Seca, Super Rivalries, Traveler of the Burning Abyss, Secret Rare Brilliant Fusions, uh, uh, Super Gozens, and then Watt Kinetics. 
Uh, three rare Sekka's Lights. Again, these are all just playsets of cards that I might find myself playing in the future. Um, Lamparinkus, this card comes up a lot in certain extra decks. That card I might use in something. Three Hippo Shinogen, uh, two Spanish Shi Archivers there next to the Tatsunoko. Three Temperance of Prophecy. Uh, then here we got uh, Rocky Boys, some Fusions, uh, the Seamoth's Thesis, the Secret Rare Serapinite, Griffin Bahamut Shark, all that stuff. This one is uh, English. Um, then we have two Agar Pain, two Proxy, two Link Spider, one Gumblar, one Firewall, and one Trigate. Two of everybody's favorite Link Monsters right there, let me tell you that. Um, then here we have uh, Toad, Gaios, or not Gaios, Draco Saga, Ult, or... Um, Boulder Reasoning, Shared Rides, Undines, and Swaps. Obviously, since I have uh, the Rarity Bump versions of these, I do have these in DT and Aldi. Um, Dogman, this is extra Dante Gold Rare, because I got like sent this for free in the mail. Extra Alistair Invoker of Madness. Um, more extra deck monsters here. One one Witch's Strike that I pulled out of a box. Uh, Judgments, waiting for these to come back. And uh, two Rubik's. Two Nightmare Goblin, yeah, waiting for that card. Someday, we might see it come back again. Uh, Dark Graffer Ultra Rare Teuses, a super rare um, salvage. I used to have a German one of these a long time ago, but I got rid of it. Um, Nightmare Ibli, this is one of three that I have. The other two are my friends. I still have two in Orcus, so I do have three of these. Uh, Ulti Lind, uh, this is a Shatterfoil uh, Battle Pack Emerald. Um, Secret Rare Maxi and a Common. No, the Secret Rare is still like $20 or something. Uh, the low rarity Mermail stuff, we have the Teuses and the Dragoons, uh, one Power Giant, two of these, and then I have a Time Thief core, uh, I don't know why, I just do. Some other random stuff here, Strikes, Order, um, two Raigekis, one's Ultra, one's Secret, uh, another Gun, Super Rare, Ulti Sphere, another Super Heavy Infantry, uh, DT Birdman down here, a Harvey's Feather Duster out of SDD, I'm not sure what set that is and uh more random stuff here and that is it i believe oh and a malacious and a brass bombard yeah so yeah my binder is not the greatest i get that but uh it could uh be better like i said if i put all the stuff that i had in the decks that i use in there but again that would just be way too much of a hassle now we're on to uh the first binder here the other binder which is one of my brother's binders uh, does like to collect alties so this is basically everything in here is ultimate rare so yeah everything in this binder is ultimate rare you just collect ultimate rares uh, i know a lot of people like to do that and uh something i i kind of would like to do at some point but it's just really 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 expensive um so yeah we have on the first page here mobius's silver sentinels and dark knight parshaths all the um all first dead two of these are first dead and then all these are first dead as well um, not that it really makes too big a difference for those cards. Um, yeah, some of these all these are just random all these. Some of them are really nice. Uh, then we have Fog Kings, Twisters. Six Twisters, actually. And this one here is German. An alti German Twister. Uh, Sephira's, Etelis, and Wonder Wands. These are not first ed. They, uh, they could be, though. Um, <laughs> then we have on the next page here, uh, three Pulling the Rug. It used to be an old uh, side deck card people used to play against, I think, Teller Knight. Three uh, Honor Arcs, all first ed. Three Trap Six Trap Hole Nightmare. Three Felgrand, three Big Eye, three Boxia. Uh, all ultimate rare in their own rights. And then this is the page here. This is the this is the absolute god tier page he's been working on for quite some time. Uh, so we have three ultimate rare Psalm Strikes. Three ultimate rare Judgment Dragons um, out of Turbo Pack 1. Then we have three ultimate rare Instant Fusions. Uh, three ultimate rare maxis, all English, and they're all near mint. Uh, three first ed uh, near mint effect veilers, and three first ed ultimate rare uh, DD crows, uh, to sort of ice uh, to put the uh, the icing on the cake, if you will. I don't know. Uh, so yeah, that is, there's that page. It's a pretty nice page. Um, then on the next page here, we have three dark rebellion exceeds dragons, all first ed. We have some trishes, two alties, and one dual terminal. And then the other dual terminal monsters, the uh, Deloran, the Brianic, and the Gungnir. I have this one, this one, and this one. Still need to get my hands on these, but these are like 130 or something right now. Ridiculous. Um, three Star Eaters, three Ulti Breakthrough Skills, all first dead. And then three Ultimate Rare Mystical Space Typhoons. And then some other Ultis here. We got a playset of Night Beams, uh, two Spell Shattering Arrows, uh, Insector Sword, Zect Caliber, I guess? I don't know. Transmigration Prophecy. 
Uh, some warnings over here, Dark Laws, Omegas, and a Yazi, Ultimate Rare. Um, two Vanities Fiends, uh, Blackwing Card, Mid Shield Gardena, uh, Brotherhood of the Firefist, Tiger Kings, Giga Brilliance, and Princess Pikaru. Then we have two Red Eyes Flare Metal, one First Dead, one Not, two Deltaros, uh, two Leo Arms, two Majestic Star Dragons, two Artifact of Rendles, one Cowboy, and then two Dark Blade, the Dragonites. It's a pretty cool looking ulti. Um, then over here, we just have a bunch of other random alties. I'll just point out some of the uh, more noteworthy ones, like Tsukiyomi, uh, Gaia Dragon. We got uh, Ignis or Prominence and Castell. Uh, cool Mecha Phantom Beast Hamstrad, actually. Mermail Abyss Baleen. This is the one card I wish they would never have printed alti, and they would have just like printed Megalo alti or something, which I feel like they could have done. Um, I guess you'd have to go back and look what the ultimate rares were out of Abyss Rising. I don't know. Uh, on this page here, we got some numbers ones like Lila, uh, Bountiful Artemis, uh, Blue Eyes White Dragon, uh, some pretty cool cards here, Herald of Green Light, Cloudian Sheep Cloud, uh, Fuseler Dragon, the Dual Mode Beast, I didn't even know that card came Ultimate Rare, um, they printed some, they printed some weird Ultimate Rares back in the day, uh, Hero Fan of Prophecy, like, like, Allura Queen, Level 5, uh, Earthbound Immortal, Chaku Kalhau, I don't even know how to say that, Empress of Prophecy, Venus Chain, Gaios, and number 62 Prime Photon, the good old D-Chain over here. Uh, then we've got Gauntlet Launcher, 107, Dandelion, Treeborn Frog, Levian or Le Levier, the Sea Dragon, uh, Thunder King Ryo, and Evolves our Lagia, cool number 9 Dyson Sphere is there as well. Uh, then we got Odd Eyes Vortex, Deck Devastation Virus, and an Ultimate Rare Card Crush First Edition. This is also First Edition. Uh, Shack, Black Rose, um, number uh, 92 Hard Earth Draco. Also got a Scrap Dragon here. Uh, also the H on this uh, Hard Earth Draco. The the H, this other H is capital, which is weird. I don't know if that's like a misprint or if it's just supposed to be like that in all of them. I have no idea. Um, you Bell, Terror, Incarnate. Uh, then here we got a one, uh, Ulti Chalice. One system down over here in Allure of Darkness, a rank up Magic Astral Force. Uh, Rise of the Storm Monarch. And then on here we've got, uh, the Brain Control looking very, very nice. And then some, uh, uh, not sure, a uh, Hobby League. Two Hobby League Shining Angels over there. Uh, so pretty cool looking cards. So that's it for that binder, the Ulti binder. And then I got one other binder that's my brother's. Like I said I had to put these in the video or else my binder would be kind of kind of whack. I don't know. Uh, so this is one sort of like a playset binder, if you will. I guess that's how I could put it. Um, that's the front page. Not too, nothing too really special there. Uh, all the True Kings, all the way down to Liz's Gasm and uh, Mariame. Star Seraph, Stick and Chair. Uh, just some really good play sets for other things. Like he, yeah, he helps me uh, put together a lot of decks I don't have stuff for. Uh, like if I were to play Iron Draw and Trains, I got the playset right here. Union Hanger Goods, Ragaki Cosmic Cyclones, My Body's a Swag, uh, all DT. Uh, very, very nice looking card. Especially in Dual Terminal. Three Ultra Instant Fusions, Dual Alliance, Tune Tables, Desires, Spiritual Swords, That Grass looking greener. Um, Unending Nightmares, Super Wakings, Mask of Restricts, Typhoons, Red Reboots, Im Ultra Rare Imperial Iron Walls. Uh, we got the hand trap page. We've got bells. We've got reapers. We've got ash blossoms. We've got droll and locks. We've got DD crows. We've got ghost ogres. You name them, we got them. Then we also got uh, the gammas here as well. Uh, Sky Cal or Samurai Calvary of Reptier. Card actually used to be a pretty cool card. Uh, Shinri Solitaire, Kaikus, Super Rare Ghost Destroyers, uh, Monarchs uh, Stormforth. We got all fire and ice hands, A, B's, and C's, all secret rare. Uh, then we got Morays, Hate True Nades, Painful Decisions, Card of Demise, Summoner's Art, Overload Fusion, Monarchs Erupt, Escape from the Dark Dimension, Glow Up Bulbs, Gen Knight Lazuli, Alistair the Invoker and Super. And we got some gadgets here. A lot of True Draco stuff here as well. He does play True Draco, more True Draco stuff here. Uh, all the other True Draco monsters, Triple Masterpiece, First Ed, uh, Original Set. We got True King's Return. Uh, then we got a Mirror Force page. We got pretty much every Mirror Force on here except for Blazing. Uh, three Launcher, three Quaking, three Mirror Force, three Storming, three Drowning, and Triple Witch's Strike. Then here we've got three D Barrier, Wire Taps, uh, we got some Storm Dusters, and then Triple Evenly Matched down here. Um, 
super rare for bin lances these this card actually looks super super nice and super rare that's one of the i think the more underrated super rare cards especially since this card can come up as a nice tech card at some formats uh twins there can be only ones rivalries and gozens uh lots of light sworn stuff here pretty much all the light sworn stuff uh anti spells brilliant fusion inspector borders and ross veer modes uh and super rare terraformings as well super rare looking very nice sylvans uh, more Sylvan stuff, Lone Fires, Harpy Feather Duster, um, some Monarch stuff, Chaos Emperor Envoy, the end, uh, Ultra Rare, Unlimited or Limited Edition. Uh, I'm not sure what set that came out of. And then on the back here, we got a First Edition Secret Rare uh, Eradicator Epidemic Virus, two Imperial Orders, uh, both from First uh, Pharaoh Servant, one First Dead, one's not. First Dead Raw Yellow Mega Pack, Super Poly Secret. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And a uh, snatch deal as well. So yeah, that's it for this little binder showcase video. I thought I'd do this as sort of like a fun little video. Haven't done one of these in a long time. So hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like. Um, I probably won't do one of these again for a while unless something changes majorly in any of these binders. Um, but yeah, until then, hope you guys enjoyed this fun little video. This will probably be a double upload the day I upload this. So. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Like I said, nothing's for trade for sale. If you leave a comment asking, how what's your value on this? We begin over this. I'm not gonna answer it. Um, so yeah, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. It's always more to kill signing out, and we'll see you in the next one.